Welcome to Ayoma Leaves. Today we are in Machakos. We're going to take a tour of Machakos town, which is also called Masaku, the capital city of Machakos County, one of the 47 counties of Kenya. Let me start by surprising you. Did you know that Machakos was established in 1887, 10 years before Nairobi? Yes. Machakos was actually the first administrative center for the British colony. The capital was moved to Nairobi in 1899 when Machakos was bypassed by the Uganda Railway that was under construction. So technically speaking, Machakos is the oldest administrative municipality in East and Central Africa. Yo, I'm sure you didn't know that. Comment down below. In the meantime, look at that. It's super clean. Look at the streets, how clean they are. So organized. The roads, the traffic rules are being adhered to. Machakos is underrated. I did not expect this, actually. Look at that. Yo, comment down below and let me know. Machakos town is on a hilly terrain and is surrounded by Iveti hills, which are great for camping and hiking. The local climate is semi-arid with an altitude of about 1,000 to 2,100 meters above sea level. The county is banking on projects such as the Konza Technology City, which is a new Machakos city, and also its proximity to Nairobi County to boost its economy. To be honest, I'm utterly surprised. See how clean the streets of Machakos are. Do you think, uh, this is just a by the way, yeah? Do you think Machakos town is cleaner than Kisumu? Uh, <laughs> comment down below, yo. These streets are super clean, yo. I did not expect this, to be honest. Right there ahead is uh, the police station, Machakos Town Police Station. Whenever you see um, such signposts, you just know those are county government officers. <laughs> have noticed that most of the popular Kenyan banks have their branches in Machakos, yo. Look at that, that's the most, yes! <laughs> to move around town, it's quite easy using the border borders, yes, yes. And that's what I used during this trip. <laughs> to move around uh, town and to be very flexible, plus they are very, very affordable. You see that, fans? That is the famous Mulu Mutiswa Garden. Believe it or not, this is the Machakos bus station that is popularly known as Machakos Airport. <laughs> and it's the only station in the whole town. So all vehicles to whichever part of the country are found here. Oh, yo, Machakos Level 5 Referral Hospital. Nice. And right across is Titot Restaurant, one of the oldest restaurants in Machakos that is known for the best samosas in Kenya. Check out that previous video I did of Titot Restaurant in Machakos. Believe it or not, on the left there is the Isili of Machakos. Yes, I'm sure you did not know that.
we are approaching Machakos University and I want you to just check out the gate. <laughs> yeah, have a glimpse. That is Machakos University right there. We are going to the Kenyatta Stadium where some uh, most of Kenyan Premier Leagues happen. Eh? <laughs> Kenyatta Stadium in Machakos County. Home ground to Sofa Faka. Yay! <laughs> Oh, the prison! The prison! Mavinia and Diti! This is the Macheco Stadium where some Kenyan Premier Leagues happen. It was recently renovated. Eh? It's called Kenyatta Stadium. There's a time they wanted to rename it to Kalonzo Musioka Stadium, but they didn't. <laughs> yeah! It's also the home ground to Sofa Parker. Look at that. A lot of Kenyan Premier Leagues happen here. The main economic activities of Machakos include livestock farming, fruit farming, sand harvesting, mining, and trade. Despite its semi-arid climate, Machakos is famous for its sweet mangoes, oranges, avocados, macadamia, and other types of fruits. Uh, also, French beans, coffee, sorghum, pineapples, and guess what? All these reach the supermarkets and processed. Therefore. There is a huge opportunity in processing and value addition to these products. We are actually going to see the local market here yeah, to have a glimpse at some of the products. One thing I love about Machakos that tops everything else, yeah, are the views. When I just see hills everywhere, <laughs> to me it's very priceless and therapeutic. This part of the town is known to host most of the hardwares, mainly owned by the Indian community. Now, welcome to my favorite part of the video. No, no, no. Is this the second one? The first one was the one for the heels. Yo, this is the market where fresh produce uh, straight from the farms and processed are sold. Yay! <laughs> I love me some good organic food. Yes, and Machakos is, is known for that. If you want the most loyal and honest people in the world, are the people from Machakos County. Comment down below and support that statement. <laughs>
How about we head over to Galleon Hotel and have an aerial view of the town. Galleon used to be the tallest building, but now there's a new building in the town called Chaka, which is now the tallest building. But either way, the view from the top, the rooftop of Galleon Hotel is spectacular. Wait for it. Look at that view! Oh no! The view from this point is spectacular, amazing! But have you noticed something? The roofs have the same kind of roofing material. Is it a thing of machacos? Please let us know. A tour of Machakos town cannot be complete before having a glimpse at the White House. Yes, believe it or not, this is the governor's office, famously known as the White House. Look at that. It's spectacular. This is the legacy of Dr. Alfred Mutua.